food is not expensive in China. Hello everyone, this is me Dr. Sonia Rose and I am here with a new vlog. So in this vlog, I want to tell you that we uh, friends travel for like two hours straight as we were craving for Pakistani food. So yes, we went to a restaurant, it is in Shaoxing and its name is Hujra restaurant. That's so good. Literally, whenever we go to a restaurant in China, like a Pakistani restaurant or an Indian restaurant in China, so you, that's extremely expensive, extremely expensive. Not affordable for the students, especially, okay? And the food is like average. Always, whenever I tried, I went to Beijing, I went to many other cities and I tried so many Pakistani foods. But this restaurant has the best food, seriously, and affordable for the students. Yes, that has the best food I have ever tried. So yes, um, in this vlog, I will tell you the journey from uh, Subway to, to that restaurant and then the food and then coming back. So keep watching the video and no, keep watching the video till the end. And this is the Subway sound coming from the back. So bear it with me. So you have to see me here. I had a little bit of a shush because the sunlight was very good. This is the open subway so it was very fun. So here we were talking and we almost reached. It was a good journey. Yeah. So here going out from the subway. Look at the subway station. Here in Pakistan you can see any other place. इतनी अच्छी इतनी खूबसूरत नहीं कर सकती। So here I'm calling my friend to come with me. Maybe I was feeling alone. That's why. So yeah, here we are going out. It's daytime. It's sunny. It's so good. We were enjoying. मौसम भी बहुत अच्छा था, बहुत मजा आ रहा था रास्ते में। तो यहाँ से थोड़ा सा by walk हमने आगे जाना था। It's like maybe 500 meters or or about five. चलते जाओ। I don't know the name. What's the name of the restaurant? Even I don't know the name. Nice. Yes. And you told us to come here all huh. the way from Beijing to Shaoxing huh. for our Pakistani restaurant. We yes. don't know even the name, right? It's fine. No problem. Nice. Very nice. Let's see. I if, like the confidence. Let's see if we are able to go there or not. Where? I wish. To the restaurant? Yes. No, we have to go now. Yes. We travel for two hours in the subway, right? It's okay. We can go back if we don't find. Don't tell me. I'm so hungry now. Literally, I'm we so have hungry. a McDonald's right back. No, I don't. I don't want to eat from McDonald's. Sure. No. Chale. Doorte. Then let's see. What happens? We will find. Inshallah. Yeah. So this is the restaurant. We came inside, and now we are waiting for our food. I'm just trying to make video. So here you can see the menu. The so many choices, so many dishes, so many things. Seriously, we were so excited, so excited to see the especially the prices. The prices are so low, so affordable, especially for the students. And here comes another thing that this was so they see really, really so they see that they were writing. They asked us to write the f food items we wanna order in in Urdu. So that was the maybe first time I ever tried writing Urdu in China. Yeah, <laughs> I did it, and I was really enjoying this, uh, really enjoying this part. So here comes the food. That was so good. We ordered nihari, we ordered korma, we ordered pulao. No, no, this is biryani actually, and then the rotis, and then there was the uh, what's that? It's it's raita, yeah, it's raita. And at the end, the tea was fantastic. Yeah. Okay. Okay, uh, I haven't mentioned one thing here that food is not expensive in China, like their own cuisine, like normal food, whenever you go to a, a Lanjo Lamian, a Muslim restaurant, not Pakistani, Muslim restaurant, that's not expensive, but when you go to eat a specific cuisine, like Indian cuisine or Pakistani cuisine, that's expensive. 
Like you'll have to pay uh, 50 or 60 RMB for one dish, yes. And the serving is only 400 gram. Like normally you get in Pakistan for like maybe 1000 or something, but here it's expensive. Even for yogurt, even for yogurt. I was, yesterday, I was uh, just calculating that how much yogurt you get when you go to a Indian restaurant, like it's near. Uh, I, I don't want to mention the name of the restaurant, but I was uh, calculating that you, you pay 25 RMB for only 400 gram or maybe 350 gram of uh, yogurt, okay? Which is like 1000 rupees of in, in Pakistani rupees. But that restaurant in which we went today, that's only for 7 yuan. Yeah, that much cheap. Just see, 25 RMB and 7 RMBs. Yeah, that's the difference. That's why I'm telling you that it was so affordable and so yummy. You, you know that feeling when you eat good food in affordable price? So your body is like, every cell of your body is happy. That's what I'm so yeah, feeling everyone, now. That was all about my vlog. Hope you liked the video. Please like, share, and subscribe. Wait till my next vlog. Till then, Allah Hafiz. Bye-bye. Thank you so much.